stay there. So you are working on your HubSpot website. Your team is all roaring and ready to go. But now you are running into a peculiar problem. How do I add meta tags to my website or blog on HubSpot? So is that so difficult? Absolutely not. We are here to tell you how to do this. So guys, in order to add meta tags to your HubSpot website or page, firstly click on marketing, click on website, then click on website pages. Here, your website pages will open up. Maybe I want to add meta tags to my sample website page. The process is similar for blogs as well. So that's easy. You click on settings on the right. Now go down. Here's an option to add meta description and featured image is also something that we already told you about. If you go further down, there are also options related to footer HTML and head HTML. So in case you want to add meta tags, you can add custom HTML meta tags over here. Or other than that, there's the meta description, which tells you more about what exactly is there on this page. This is a sample page. And this is something that will be visible to search engines as well. So guys, meta tags can be of various types. One of these types is the page title, which is the meta tag for titles. And then you have the meta description, which is also something which is a part of meta tags. And if I go to the custom HTML section, I can also add in maybe a few other custom codes. For example, I have the meta name keywords wherein the content is the keywords that I want that search engine should know my pages about. For example, I have just written sample keyword one, sample keyword two, sample keyword three over here. Other than that, when there's the meta robots tag, here we are asking robots that this page is an index page. That means that they can index it. We are allowing all robots to crawl and access this page and follow means that they can follow this page and the links on this one. That's something. And in the meta tag for content type, we are telling search engines what kind of content is present on this page and what kind of character set is it using. So in this case, it's using UTF-8. And other than that, there's the meta name for language. So all of these different types of meta tags allow search engines to better understand what kind of content you are pushing out on your page. And it can be pasted in the header HTML section inside additional code snippets. Once all of this is done, click on the cross button, click on update and your changes would be live. So guys, I hope these steps were quite easy to follow. And in case you are still running into any issues or errors, feel free to comment down below and we at CTA9 are always glad to assist you. In case you are building something of your own on HubSpot or you want to know more about HubSpot as a platform, do reach out to us for a free one-on-one -on -one consultation call which can be accessed via the link in the description below, in the pinned comment below or via the QR code on the screen in front of you. And I'll see you guys soon in the next video.